I'm a little excited. I got a phone call from Micro Center that Gavin's 13th birthday present has arrived and I am on my way to go pick it up. It. You know, here it says 13.3, uh, 3.1 gigahertz, 16, 16 gig, gigs, 512. 5, Brilliant. All right, so I've got the laptop. Um, the reason why I bought it at Micro Center is they had a sale, and if Micro Center has a sale, they'll honor that sale price on special order items as well as whatever they have in stock, which is really cool. Otherwise, I would have just ordered the thing right off of Apple's website. I didn't buy this for him myself. This was a combination of myself, his dad, and Gavin's grandparents all pitching in to, uh, to get him the special present. So here it is. It's gonna stay in the shrink wrap. He asked me, uh, you know, he, he obviously knows about it because he asked for this. He told me that when it came in, please don't open it, don't set it up. He wants to be the one to break the shrink wrap. I'm gonna gift wrap it for him and hide it in his dad's closet. And then when we're all there together and we decide, we're gonna give it to him. Here we are on the back trails, looking for firewood. Gavin's our little explorer here. We're following him on the motorcycle. How you doing, big man? Yeah. All right. So we got that big stump up, but how's it gonna stay? We're gonna put it in there. Yeah, we'll hold everything down. There we go, yay. Like it was meant to be. So I am packed up with Rango and crickets and mealworms and everything you need to take care of a chameleon. Um, right before I started the camera, I accidentally knocked over the crickets into the back seat and the thing fell upside down and almost dumped them all out in the car. That would have stunk. Back to the campsite and here's the mud pit we gotta go through. But that's a nice looking mud pit. Be fun uh, if I wanted to wreck my truck. Here's how we do it. Three families up here right now. So there's the big cabin tent right there. And we got another camper. And then we got another camper right down there. And we'll show you the fire here in a little bit. So we were gonna sit down to have a family dinner, but it turns out that the chicken, whatever it is, it looks good. Chicken. It's, uh, it has blackened spice on it. Blackened chicken. It was too spicy for the girls, so Christina's cooking something else for them. Well, our day shows over there. I've been busy. Why are you giving me a single green bean? What's because wrong with it? Because of that. Because of the hole in it? <laughs> it tastes good with a hole in it. Max. Hey, good boy. Look. Gavin, say hello. Hi. That wasn't hello. Seven by three and a half. It'll go blazing later. We'll check out the uh, inside. It's not as comfortable as uh, that big boy, but it gets the job done and well, I'm off the ground. Sleeps four comfortably. Here's Gavin's queen size bed in here. We got a table and then I have my queen size. So it's, uh, it's comfortable. Here's the uh, view. Well, all you see is forest, but it's a beautiful thing.
So this is how we camp and it's gonna be another two families tomorrow and then another two families on Friday. That's our firewood. We hope it gets us through tomorrow afternoon. We'll have go get two more loads. Beautiful. It's 8.30 right now.